Hello everybody, my name is Grim Scythe, and welcome back to another episode of Planet Base. We last left off, we are trying not to starve to death here, so we're hoping that that goes better. Ooh, we got some more vegetables now, that's good. And we're getting some starch in, so we should start seeing some bioplastic getting produced, which we are. Good, good. I think this, the next thing we build is another um, food production, because this, this cannot continue. Uh, right now we just have vegetables. They should be getting made into meals though, shortly. Yeah, yeah. Good stuff, good stuff. Yeah, we're gonna need to build one more of these. Um, so that's on the agenda right now. Uh, I think the, f the power storage should keep us safe for a bit in that regard. Uh, that was not what I wanted. Let's see, what was it under? struck over there. I heard it. Okay, we need um, biodome. Oh, we could have built a bigger one. That would have that would have been better. But <clears throat> right now, I think we're just going to go with one more small one. We'll have to connect that. I think this will be enough to sustain our people right now. People that are still quite hungry. There's meals sitting in there, so you just need to go sit down and eat. There you go. There you go. Alright, so. Oh, you know, I didn't think about that. There was that injured guy. Um, maybe we need to put in some sort of sick bay first. You know what? Let's. Um... Sorry, I'm gonna cancel that. I need to put in the sick bay first. So I don't want my guy dying on me. Um, just gonna be a small one for now. Let's connect the sick bay off of the leisure room. Do that right there. <clears throat> yeah, plenty of power storage now. I think that'll be fine. Sick bay first, and if we have enough materials, we'll do one more of the of the food rooms. But this guy not doing well with the busted leg. Needs to be treated. Needs to be treated. <clears throat> Feel bad that little robot brought that stuff all the way over here. I was like, nope. Change of mind. And take it back. Poor guy. Poor guy. Condition's good. We definitely need to get a robot facility, though, going as soon as we can. And get off your leg if it's broken, man. Just, just sit down. We don't need you. Look, you don't even have anything to do. Silly, silly man. Uh, this needs maintenance, and we're not getting it. I'm not sure why. Not sure why. People are sleeping, that's why. That's where the high maintenance comes into play, right? They just, um... They have troubles when they... Overnight, when people are sleeping. Yeah, get on that, please. Deteriorating on our, on our food. We can't have that. We need that food. Desperately, you guys aren't even going to eat today if you don't make this. If these all come to fruition today, we'll get eight more food, which will keep us going. We currently are sitting on one more meal. So this should be sustaining, actually, enough for each cycle, as long as we get these maintained properly. Because if we lose, if it degrades, we're probably not going to get our full harvest, and they're going to be in trouble. It looks like we're getting fixed up now. Nice and good there. Okay. Good stuff. And what are we lacking over here? We're lacking bioplastic. Where did it go? Can you make some? Here we go. Sitting on enough starch. It's just got to get worked. It was at nighttime. Everybody was sleeping. This poor guy is walking around on a broken leg. And you're just you're sleeping. Think of this poor guy. Alright, we should be getting... It takes a while. It's unfortunately quite slow. I might want to double down on these um, these rooms here. These are... Is this sitting on iron too? Yeah. So we need to 
We need to double down. I don't know why other people would just be standing around. Are you just... What are you doing? Can I, like, assign somebody to this thing? I don't, I don't understand what they're doing. It's like a priority... No, it's a cycle. I saw a priority thing earlier. Base management. Yes, I thought I did. I know. If these people just harvest these, we'll have food in a minute. That one's, that one's going to be due pretty soon. I don't know if these grow once per day. So we can prioritize the work in the structure. What we should do is prioritize work in the structure though here. Because this has gotta we gotta get food or we're, all, we're done for. The rest of it can wait. I don't feel I don't feel good about the guy walking around in a broken leg, but it is what it is. It doesn't seem to be going down, it's just not in good health right now. There's that bioplastic coming down. Take it out there, little buddy. Let's get that built. We needed one there and one there. <clears throat> so once I get that second one done, we'll be in good shape. Okay, these are all getting... Well, that one's getting close, and that one's getting close. That'll give us four meals. Nobody's urgently hungry at the moment. <clears throat> In fact, most of them are in pretty good shape. I don't even think they necessarily eat like a full meal a day. I like the way the camera moves. That one's, he's getting hungry. Well, we should have at least a couple meals pretty soon here. Yeah, that one's due any second now. All right, it's just a, it's just a waiting game right now until we get materials rolling in. We're kind of stuck at this point. So I think I'm going to speed it up. Let's move it in. Get a little bit more done here. <clears throat> Alright, bringing in some food. Great. Okay, hungry guy's got a meal. Alright, I've got two harvested there. Fantastic. That one's regrowing really quick. So maybe the maintenance has more to do with how fast it grows. If it's high, it's well maintained, it grows faster. That looks to be what's going on with that. <clears throat> Alright, did we get... Okay, we got our... I'm going to set the slowness down for a second. We got our sick bay. So we need... Oh, we need more bioplastic. Rat. Well, let's start with a bed. Supplies. Maybe we need to make metal supplies? I'm curious about that actually. Well, we need a bed regardless. So this guy has a place to lay down because apparently he's not going to do it otherwise. So, once that last one gets processed there, that should help. Does it take a bioplastic to make a bioplastic maker? That's the question. It does not. You know what? Let's do... Because I think we're running high on starch now. I don't like the way these sit. Oh, we can do another one right there. Let's do that. <clears throat> Let's get that made. Maybe we can get two people doing bioplastic at the same time. I think we're sitting on starch somewhere. Yeah, we're sitting on four starch. It's just taking forever to get processed. Bed has been built, so hopefully dude can go lay down. I'm not sure if he can or not. And we may as well request the medical cabinet. Um, we don't have the supplies yet, but it should be next on the prairie. <clears throat> I 
out of food again. That one is taking, seems like, a lot longer to grow than it should. I don't think it's growing as fast as it sounded like it was supposed to. Oh, there's more meals sitting there, though. That's good. We're out of food, but nobody's starving, so we're okay. Alright, he's resting now. That's good. Hopefully the health will go up even without medical supplies, but we'll see. We'll see. Let's move it back up a little bit. We're waiting for people to sleep and do whatever. What are, you, what are you doing right here? Oh, you're repairing the robot. Okay, cool. So we don't need a... I thought, I thought for sure we need a facility to deal with robot repair. When I played the tutorial, but they weren't repairing the robots, but it may have just been the way the AI worked in the tutorial. <clears throat> so, people sleeping. And let's see, these can hopefully get maintained. This. Yeah, we got food coming now. Alright, I think we're going to start getting flush on foods shortly. Pretty shortly here. We may even end up needing another meal maker to store the food. I think that they may... Well, actually, they may... They may just put their food over there after if it gets full. I'm not sure, though. But they're definitely eating it up. <clears throat> but uh, next is for sure I need to get another, another food making room because... I don't want to be struggling day after day to feed my people. I want to start storing food up. Because that's uh, it's not the way to do it. You can't have the people stressed about having food or not having food. We have spares. I'm not even sure what that's for. Sandstorm. Oh, crap. Um, well, let's see. Security controls. Uh, alert status. Yellow. All you... Stand doors and medics and guards are on extended duty. You might choose a setting during disaster to prevent colonists from getting hurt. So I think I'm going to do that. Red alert soon as yellow, but colonists will try to attack any intruders. So yeah, we're going yellow alert here. If I can figure out how to do that. Um, where was the... Was it? Where was it? <clears throat> um, disasters. That's not telling me. Well, sandstorm is probably. While they're passing by, solar panels will cease to operate, but wind turbines will work at full power. Well, I don't think I have them outside a lot right now, actually, but I do need to figure out how to do uh, alert controls at some point. I don't see it here now, though. Right, well, I think other than them temporarily go between the mine, we're not really sitting anybody outside right now. Uh, maybe it's in here. Okay, we got a medical cabinet now. I don't know how we make medical supplies yet. So we need to figure that out. I'm somewhat concerned about... Maybe I need a... Oh, I need a control center, I think, it looks like, to, to activate uh, alert statuses. So I don't really have any option about what's going on right now. Okay, so... Oh, they are bringing medical... We do have medical supplies. Okay, from the ship, I think, initially. It looks like maybe the dude who had the broken leg is, is okay now. What I just need to make sure I don't do is have any outside building getting done at this moment. For the safety of both my bots and my people. Yeah, we had some medical supplies stored up over here, so it's going to store them over here now. I may even want to get... One more medical... Nah, it's probably one's fine for now, actually. I don't want to do any supplies that I don't even really have right now. And actually, it's listed right there. Okay, that sandstorm's gone. That's good. So, what do we need to get 
another one of these going. So when you couldn't just build it up <clears throat> um, on its own. I think we'll try other options too with another building. All right, so. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Biodome. So it's just going to take two of each. So we're just going to be waiting on the on the bioplastic, <clears throat> and then also we'll need another one of each to make the connection. So we're going to be waiting on bioplastic for a little bit here. That one's actually got some in it. it just needs to be hauled out. We got two actually sitting in there. They just need to be moved. <clears throat> Maybe even three. Okay. So these are both working now. That's definitely going to help us with getting uh, through the starch a little faster. We're definitely going to need to probably double that up even more um, soon. Well, I don't know if we can have enough colonists to maintain that, but we're going to have a lot more starch coming in. So these things are going to be working 24-7. feel a lot more confident about my power supply not dwindling me off overnight now. I should probably put another airlock in over here somewhere so they stop having to go so far around. Um, I should consider where I should do that. Maybe off of this here. Um, I think it's one of each. I'm gonna wait because I don't have the materials as it is. This guy <laughs> goes out here in the middle of the night. Mother. Sleepy. Stupid you can't, doesn't appear to be able to rename rename people because I would love to be able to do that. Maybe that's something that I can, they can add into the game. I'm not sure. I think this game's actually been out for a while, so I don't know. Maybe it's something they'll add eventually. Right, we have how many meals we have? Well, we've got between what's going to be made into meals and what we have is uh, meals already. We'll have six meals by the end of the time it's been made, so that's good. All right, we need one more bioplastic, and I think that's. Oh, it looks like we're short on steel too. We need one steel there and there. Why it doesn't say pending there. People do not want to work this ore for some reason. So show me my raw ore. Yeah, we got seven raw ore. It's just not getting it's not getting processed. Because people are sleeping right now, so that doesn't help. Now let's bump the speed up again. I think four is as fast as we can go. What is this? I just pile starch. <clears throat> I think I could squeeze another building in over here, but I might try. Storage. Bar. Oh, we gotta get a bar. probably do next time we build one of these it's gonna be a big boy this is still got plenty of storage though so we're really not in any, any situation to worry about yet there so spare parts we're gonna have to start making spare parts because that's gonna be what we need to maintain these equipment especially if crap like that hits us <laughs> so we probably need that factory sooner than later Come on guys, make that stuff. We need it. Can we get that? Okay. And we're just pinning we're just pinning iron at this point. Or at um excuse me, metal. Generic metal. Whatever metal you got, that's what we need. 
That's all we need. Oh, here we go. Hooray! Now we just need... Oh, it looks like they got that. Okay, fantastic. Got there. Now, let us put in some other things that we don't have. Um, slow down for a second. Hydroponic vegetable pad. Uh, can we even do those? I'm curious. Fast production, high maintenance for lettuce and tomatoes. These don't really specify. We also haven't made wheat, I think. Oh no, we didn't do wheat. Consume some oxygen at night. Colonists can relax by looking at it for a bit. Interesting. Medicinal pad, vegetable pad where grow medicinal plants. So we may want to do that for a couple of these actually. Let's do a tomato and a lettuce. And we need at least one of those. Maybe some onions. Slow production and low maintenance. Um, let's just do one of those. We probably can worry about more of that later, but I want to get at least one coming in. It requires GM tomato DNA. Hmm. Um, so let's take onions as well then. Looks like tomatoes and onions. So once we get those um, <clears throat> more bioplastic brought in, they can make the rest of these and we'll start having more food coming in. I am, however, out of time in this episode. Thank you everybody for watching. I really do appreciate it. And I'll see you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.